everyone, welcome to Passport TV, and I'm here in Bucharest, Romania, where I met through a friend, um, Sally, who is a Filipina who works here um, for for an employer. Uh, she said that she doesn't want to mention who her employer is, uh, what type of company it is, or anything like that, and I'm going to respect uh, what she's asking by not revealing such things. But this is Sally, and uh, thank you, Sally, for granting Passport TV this very, very important interview on what it's like being a Filipina working here in Romania. Thank you very much for granting permission for the interview. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> She's shy, so shy. <laughs> <I'm> shy. <laughs> I don't even know this person. <laughs> But what do you think of those two types of men that are over in your country behaving that way? No, I think this is not good people. Uh, and, and, and why? Why would you say that they're not good people? Because you don't need to make up. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> and, uh, Sally here doesn't even know what a dingleberry is. And I think if uh, I explained what a dingleberry is, she probably would look at me very strange and I've never given an explanation why I refer to the ham head as a ham head but anyway thank you once again Sally for granting me this interview and uh, we're gonna be very quick uh, she did say that she has some things to do and uh, so how long have you been here in Romania oh wait before you answer that before you answer that where in the Philippines do you come from I come from Batangas. Batangas. Yes, Batangas. Batangas. I've never been there. Never been there. And what is special about Batangas? The special in Batangas is the shrine of Saint Padre Pio. That's one of the things that are very special there. Yes, and the nice beaches. Ooh, I like me some beaches some beaches beaches not the other word i like me some beaches that's why uh never mind so the beaches and the cathedral is that what is that what you said yes national cathedral the national cathedral. and you have a family that's still living there or are they here in romania my family is still in the philippines it's okay. She's shy. She's shy. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. It's okay. I'm just an idiot. So, um, how long have you been here working in Romania? Three years and a half. Three and a half years? Yes. Again, I, I, I don't want to keep her too long because uh, she's actually... <laughs> She's actually ready to go. Um, she she wasn't even going to be able to make it for this interview today, but she said that because she promised, she would do it, and I do uh, I do appreciate it. Um, one more question, and this may, if if you were to make the same amount of money with the same opportunities uh, that you have here in Romania in the Philippines. Would you leave Romania to go back to live in the Philippines? I live in Romania. So your Romania is your home now? Yes, my home is Romania now. Okay. I have family also here. She has, she has, see when that green light moves, that means it's, it's uh, recording. It, that means it, it's, it's taking. So she, she considers uh, Romania her home now. So that's, uh, and she does speak uh, Romanian. The Romanian language. I heard her, and uh, she's she's she says she doesn't speak it well, but I heard her, and she speaks it. She speaks it. She, I think she, just like me, she understands more when she hears it than actually speaking it. But uh, one more crazy question. One more crazy question. And uh, the orange man, the crazy loud man that uh, is very angry. And uh, you know which one I'm talking about that I showed you the Arr! that guy. Um, his partner has eight children. Eight children. Uh, what do you think of a woman that would leave a husband after eight children? Do you think uh, she was she waited a little too long to leave that relationship? 
<laughs> yes. <laughs> hold on one second. Hold on because I got <laughs> that's funny. All right, folks, back very quickly. Uh, I just wanted to to make sure that she she was understanding the, the exact way that I was explaining it because because of the way I talk. So. Do you think that this woman maybe should have stopped having, uh, maybe after four kids, to leave that relationship? Or do you think that she should have maybe had uh, 11 or 12 kids before <laughs> leaving the relationship? I think she needs to stop at four kids. Four kids. So, uh, again, everybody's entitled to her, their opinion, but when you have a person that's uh, a foreigner and he's uh, feeding answers to his partner, as far as uh, it being very acceptable uh, throughout uh, their culture. Um, not every Filipino Filipina feels that way. Anyway, she's got to run. Thank you very much, Sally, for... Uh... Oh, God, wait a second. <laughs> Sorry for that interruption. Thank you very much, Sally, for your time. And again, uh, I appreciate it. You're welcome. All right, see you folks later. Passport TV, out.